The Supreme Court is officially back in session starting a new term today. With a historic makeup, including the first black woman on the high court and following a controversial few months, the justices are back to work. ABC's M. Wynn shows us what to expect. The U.S. Supreme Court is back in session and with its newest justice, Katanji Brown Jackson, the first African-American woman to be elevated to the bench. Jackson makes it the first time four women justices are serving together on the nation's highest court. Another first in more than two years, a live audience allowed inside to hear the proceedings after COVID restrictions were eased. The nine justices opened their term with oral arguments in a case involving a group of property owners and companies who are suing the Environmental Protection Agency over the scope of the Clean Water Act and the EPA's ability to regulate waterways. Jackson quick to engage with the plaintiff attorneys. Why would Congress uh, draw the coverage line between abutting wetlands and neighboring wetlands? Soon the justices will consider a new set of potentially landmark cases. On the docket, whether to end affirmative action in college admissions, allow business owners to refuse service to LGBTQ customers, and whether to give state legislatures enhanced power to oversee federal elections. As public approval for the court is at historic lows, a new Monmouth University poll finds about six in 10 Americans believe the current Supreme Court is out of touch with the values and beliefs of most Americans. M1, ABC News, Washington.